So today I'm sharing with you guys a fantastic deal on a VPN. This is for Cybersecurity Awareness Month and it's actually a 69% off deal. The deal is actually with IP Vanish, one of my favorite VPNs. And in this video, we're going to go through everything like installing, setting up, as well as performance. The first thing we're gonna cover is performance because the thing people care about most is speed. When it comes to using a VPN, you will lose a little bit of speed, but if you choose a good VPN, you won't lose much at all so the first thing I did is three different speed tests just to see how well this performs and it actually did better than last time I tested this coming in on one of the tests with a download speed of 237 megabits now when it comes to speed testing you do need to do it correctly if you are doing it yourself a lot of people get confused and just let the speed test automatically pick a server which is a completely unfair test the way you do it is manually pick your server server and use the same server for testing without a VPN and with a VPN because that means that it will be a fair test and it's always worth running a few because you can just have the server having problems but you can see from the speed results the speed is absolutely fantastic there and it's actually much better than the last time I reviewed this. Now the next reason that this is one of my favorite VPNs is simplicity. It's easy to use on all platforms for those of you that need to use it. It's it's available on the Google Play Store, it's available on Apple Store, Windows, Mac OS, even Android TV and Fire Stick. So for those of you with Fire Sticks or Fire TVs, you'll find it in your Fire OS store and it's really as easy as opening the app and connecting to a VPN. And finally, security. It is a very secure VPN. It's got 256-bit AES encryption, zero traffic logs, and of course, unlimited bandwidth. There's lots of servers in lots of different countries, so it should have everyone covered. And they allow you to use this VPN on 10 devices simultaneously. So that's at the same time, but if you're using lots of other devices, you can use as many as you want, just only 10 at the same time. But if we just take a brief look at the application, one of the things I like is simplicity. You can simply connect to a server by going server, you've got all of the countries here so you can simply just pick the one you want or you can even drill down further than that so for instance I'm in the UK and when you're using a VPN generally you always want to pick the closest location to you unless of course you're using it to access geolocked content but if you're using it for security or just to unblock your internet then the closest server is the best as it's got less distance to travel so if you wanted to connect to London United Kingdom you can simply just click on London as you can see it's already connected there's already data transferring so that was nice and simple but if we go back to the server list one thing you can do is actually pick specific servers so in that case you saw I just connected to London but if we scroll to the right you can see I've actually got 89 different servers in London if I click on 89 there you can see at the bottom a list then appears and this has all of the different servers so if there's a specific one you want to connect to you can do that and you can see it gives you load there that's actually percentages and ping is just response time so if I wanted that server I can connect to that server and simply do it that way but most of the time just clicking on the country or location will pick you the best anyway another great thing about this is if we drill down into the settings there's lots to choose from and there's settings to make sure that you are always protected say you've got an Android box and you always want that to be connected to the VPN if you come into settings you've got star IP vanish on Android startup I recommend you check that insecure network notification always leave that enabled and then IP vanish startup you can see by default it doesn't automatically connect but what you would actually want to do and what I normally do is have it to connect to the fastest server in your country so you tick that box there select your country so I'm going to scroll through United Kingdom and what this means is every time I turn on this Android box it will open IP vanish on start and connect to my fastest server available and that's pretty much the only settings you need to change you can also go into connection and you can change between TCP or UDP but generally you won't need to worry about these settings so that's pretty much it for the application and that's how easy it is to use if I wanted to get some geolock content in Australia simply click on Sydney and it will then begin connecting. It's going to take a little bit longer as you saw there because Sydney 
Sydney is the other side of the world, but it still didn't take too long and it's fully connected there. And as I said, it's available on all of the app stores, so it is nice and easy to get. Now, for those of you that want to try this or even just get the deal, I've placed the link down in the description below. It will take you to this page here. And as you can see, it's 69% off currently. This is for the whole month of October. All you have to do is click on where it says get IP vanish. And as you can see, there's three different tiers. So you can get one month, one year or two years and the longer you go for the cheaper it is if you go for two years it's the equivalent of three dollars 74 a month and that is actually billed at 89 dollars 99 so it's normally 287 but the offer brings it down to 90 dollars and this is available internationally wherever you are in the world you can sign up and a great thing about it is there's the seven day money back guarantee so if for whatever reason you're not happy just contact them and they'll give you a refund but all you have to do is enter your email and password go through the payment method so you've got your normal cards or you can even pay by paypal once you've got an account you simply head to your app store install the application use those login details to log in and you're pretty much good to go you just leave the vpn running in the background and you can enjoy all of your applications knowing that you're secure so that's pretty much it i just wanted to let you guys know about this deal and also show you that their service does seem to be improving but as always if you've got any problems any questions about this vpn another vpn or even just vpns in general leave them in the comments below and i'll get back to you as soon as i can but thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel